Hey guys, it's Rob here. Today I'm going to show you how to add a shadow effect in paint.net. So I'm going to show you two ways to do this today. Both of them are very quick and easy. One of them's just ever so slightly faster. So go ahead and create a new layer. In this new layer, add the text or the image that you want a shadow for. In this case, we're going to write banana. Now what we want to do is duplicate the layer. Click the duplicate layer button. Go to the bottom layer, go up to adjustments, brightness slash contrast, and then drag the brightness all the way down to minus 100. Now from here, what you can do, you can go to the move selected pixels tool to the left, and then you can drag this and adjust it to your liking. So it looks like the shadow is coming from whichever direction you want. Now the second way, which is faster, but requires an external plugin. This is Bolt Bait's plugin pack. It's extremely useful. I will link this in the comments and description. I highly recommend getting this. It makes you able to do so much more in paint.net and I use it all the time. So what we're going to do is select the layer. Then we simply go to effects, photo, I'm oh, sorry, object, object shadow. And then we have all these settings we can play around with. Um, you can choose a the how far away it is, the direction, the distance, the angle again, um, the intensity of the shadow. And yeah, so there you go. That's two ways to add shadow effects in paint.net. I really hope this video was helpful. And thank you so much for watching.